Okay, so we've let this thin set dry. The next step we're going to take, this is a crucial step for the steam rooms too. This is the waterproofing layer. The product we're using this time is this Laticrete waterproofing membrane. It's kind of a black roll-on rubber product is what it is. It's a two-part setup. You're going to use the black goop and then you also have this mesh fabric. The mesh fabric again only needs to go in the corners and on the seams so you'll roll on some of the goop, lay the fabric in, and then roll the goop over it. On the expanses of the cement board here, you're just going to roll on a layer of the, of the black. It's really a liquid plastic is what it ends up being, or liquid rubber. And that really is the, the full waterproofing layer that's going to make this thing a bona fide steam room. Okay, the tools you'll need to apply this laticrete are a roller and a brush. The roller is good to just help you cover up the expanses a little more quickly. The brush to brush in the corners and allow you to get into the heart of the reach places. Um, rubber gloves too are key at this point. This black goop is going to stick to anything forever once you get it on there. Okay, you can see I've gotten some of these seams taken care of, but I'm just going to show you my method here. This stuff can be pretty challenging. Uh, what you do is you dip in your roller, clean it off so you don't have a lot of dripping goop. You're going to need to get a layer down on your seam before this fabric. Nice and thick and gooey. And the porous cement board here just absorbs this stuff so quickly and it really does um, start to dry in an instant. So you've got to move kind of quick on this. Get a layer on. You have your fabric pre-cut, got your gloves, lay that in there like so, and you kind of press it on with your hand, and it stays there reasonably well. This stuff can be a challenge to work with. Sometimes you have to kind of hold it there a little bit, and you come back with a little more goo, like so. You're going to roll it on once you, get, once you get them in there into the fabric, the goop, it really sticks a lot better, you can see. So that stuff's a little bit of a challenge, this laticrete, but it really is the thing that makes the difference. It's not cheap either. You'd be amazed, uh, for this little room, you're more than $200 worth of this fabric and this roll-on stuff, pretty incredibly expensive actually, but it really does the job. So you can see that's going to stay there now. A little strip. Okay, you can see that we've gone ahead, got all the seams and corners in this room. Um, always glad to have that portion of the job over with because this fabric and laticrete stuff is somewhat difficult to work with, but we're going to go ahead and just roll off the expanses of the rest of the walls. And this laticrete stuff is what's commonly used often on the shower pan too in the floor and so of course we're going to get that. We're going to turn the whole room black.